She's a Mona Lisa. Hey guys, hello, this is still Shilo and welcome back to my channel. So today um, I'm just gonna make a vlog about what's been happening here in uh, my place and yes I am oh for some people you know that I am in Kyoto for some who doesn't know I live in Kyoto um, just near Osaka a bit near of Osaka but I am very far from the city so um, actually I have resigned and I was supposed to be going home April 2nd but in the middle of March we were able to um, like secure my plane, my flight, um, a place to stay in the Philippines for self-isolation or self-quarantine but it didn't happen. So um, we were planning that we're gonna go into isolation once we reach the Philippines before or after we enter Baguio or Benguet that's where we live me and my friend but um, sadly the planes cancelled mid-March and we were forced to actually talk to our companies again and extend. So I'm a bit glad that my company understood the situation and yeah, um, they let me extend again. I already resigned but they fixed my papers and we're gonna um, think of um, when to end again the contract okay because I don't think that this coronavirus issue especially in the Philippines would be over this more uh, April so maybe around May or June or July I don't know but I'm really hoping that it would end soon and I would be able to go home so as of now I can't book flights coming from sorry from Japan going to the Philippines right now because PAL or the Philippine Airlines also cancelled their flights Air Asia is cancelled too Jetstar is cancelled too but hopefully Jetstar would be able to offer some flights this coming weeks mm, the only problem that I actually have is that I already sent my luggages my packages back home so I don't have much right now so um, I have I only have a few of my necessities with me the ones I'm supposed to be using if I go to self-isolation <laughs> or quarantine and my clothes I rarely have clothes right now because I gave some to my friends who's going to be staying here supposed to be the ones I will be leaving behind but um, I'm glad uh, during the week that I was really stressed out on what to do we were able to go shop again shop again for clothes and necessities and my room now is it, it was actually empty a week ago but now because I shopped again the room is so full right now Maybe you wanna see it. it's not a good sight, but I'm gonna show you the realities of my room. <sighs> okay. So that's how messy my room is. So yeah, I may be staying here in Japan for three more months at most. I think that would be enough before the airlines would be open, the checkpoints in the Philippines would be okay, I think. I'm really hoping that, um, honestly, I'm really hoping that uh, the medication or the Avican that Japan is um, saying that can help treat the symptoms of corona would be distributed or must um, how to say it, produced for everyone to be able to buy really hoping for that if not I'm just hoping that um, the infection control in the Philippines would be really really better because honestly I know and Filipinos know that 
we are not ready for another Italy in the Philippines. I, I don't think that our care system is not ready for a pandemonium to happen. Okay. Once a pandemic breaks out in the Philippines, it's gonna be over, you know. Italy, Korea, it's two different situations. Korea has a very good medical um, setup for from the government. Everybody is really well, how to say it. They have, um, they receive enough and good health services and they were on time they did it after a warning broke out they did mass testing while in Italy they also have a good I think medical um, setting like they have good health services but they were late to act on it that's why they were overwhelmed and it happened and now Italy is I think better than um sorry than US right now. US is like the worst place right now. So I don't know. I think that will affect everyone's um trouble conditions I think. Also um one problem I have here is that Japan is so free right now. I'm also kinda scared why people are so free and people are just roaming around wearing masks some would won't wear a mask but it's kind of so free in my opinion that it's kind of scary they're not actually mask testing so you don't know you also don't know the real case here the real count of people here in Japan anyways that's me and my vlog for the day and yeah Please take care and boost your immune system. Also, as much as possible, don't go out only for emergency purposes. Are you um, really brave enough to go out? <laughs> okay, thank you very much and see you in the next vlog.